Welcome to Quick Learning. Today we are going to learn how to use Migo command in SAP which is used to create goods received of any purchase order or if we have to perform any material transfer from one storage location to other storage location we use this material transaction code. Most people use Migo because it has all the options for any type of movement scenarios. To execute this command we have to enter Migo on the first main page. Then the main screen appears. On this we have to select the goods received option out of the list that appears. On the second step we have to select the purchase order and then on the fourth step we have to enter the relevant purchase order number for which we are going to create the goods received. After entering the purchase order number we will press enter then a list of items will appear whose goods received is pending. We will check that material, we will enter the quantity, we will, we will enter the delivery note and then we will press the check button if there is any error. If there is not any error we will press the post button and a material document number will appear at the bottom of the page. So, this is the simple process to create the goods received for any material. Similarly, if we have to perform material transfer from one storage location to other storage location, we have to select the transfer posting option on step number 2. And the next step we have to enter the material document number or the material code. Then we have to enter the relevant material code, its storage location, its batch, its quantity, its valuation type. And in this way we can easily transfer one material from its present storage location to some other storage location. So this MIGO command is very much effective command to perform any type of transaction related to the movement of materials. Hope you have enjoyed this lesson. For any queries you can always contact in the comment section. Thank you so much.